Re this is a rematch from uh, uh, pools. It was game five, but it was also said that didn't matter because Zelda was already up 2-0 in the group and LHG was already 0-2 in the group. So it was technically a set that didn't matter. Oh, sure. It's actually funny. I was actually playing LHG like a while ago, and he was actually talking to me about this and the Peach matchup specifically about how they're really bad for Yoshi, so. Yeah, I agree. Peach destroys Yoshi. Yeah, and uh, he was actually. Oh, that's brutal. Yeah, because I know Zelda just kind of Wally mops Yoshi pretty hard. Yoshi has a really hard it's time. Not, it's not Wally mops, it's Molly mops. But, Same thing. Uh, no, they're not. Okay. One of them. One of them is. Wally is not a word. Molly yeah, is a word. Say yeah, that's everyone and named Wally. Yeah, back for kills. It's not but yeah, spell, like, but fair enough. All the all the armor though is like great until you find a character with multi hits that each do six percent, and it's like, oh, this is bad actually. And then you have serious problems ever getting in. And even if you do, it's like, how are you killing Zelda like straight up air? Like, not really. You can't really convert into that off of any move. And if you're hitting Zelda with a stray aerial, like, well, I don't know what that Zelda player is doing. Not spamming jab enough, I guess. He's making it work. Using the tricky movement. I know this is a, this is a brilliant matchup. But Zelda, Zelda does. Gotta just it's technically game five, and it was still close. Have Zelda did still win? So I favor Zelda in, a, in an actual important game that actually matters. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like the uh, the usage of down B here from uh, from LHG is probably the way to go. I feel like that's gonna be your best kill option, honestly. Just like catching. No jump. Zelda somehow. Yeah, jumpless. Yeah, forward air and back air are still super strong. This is one of those matchups where I can't talk about details because I don't even come close to playing either of these characters, so... I've played Zelda a little bit. The the, the concept of is, hey, look at my multi-hits. Can you deal with my multi-hits? And for a lot of characters, the answer is no. So also, LSG playing. with these egg rolls has been, was legit in the set I remember watching, so... Yeah, egg roll's strong. I remember, because I was playing him a while ago. I just remember those egg rolls. That's like a good-ass move. Like, I don't I remember, remember playing being Kuro in like a non-PR event, and he was like ro owning me with these. Egg roll combos. Like, I just could not handle it. Oh, yeah. And that was in Peach Yoshi. Yeah, send this my goat for real. Yet again. Uh, Shout out to Cinecrow getting wrecked by Billy in like the most tragic 3 I've ever seen. It was really. Because I remember it was in like 5v5. We were hyping up so much because they played in bracket like a month or two ago and Cinecrow actually won. It ended up being like 2 0, and that was when Billy like went on go like a great top 6 finish. Yeah, and he actually was going crazy that entire turn. He'd be like Volley be like someone else like yeah i think got fifth be you like he's going crazy that tournament right but the winner he lost to Kuro. and so we were like okay this would be a hot set and then billy just owns him in like eight minutes like the most brutal 3-0 ever and like bro and to this day we still mean about how it was like the most anticlimactic set ever like like, yeah. like right now this game is much closer than billy versus Kuro right now so yeah. Yeah, something I'm actually noticing about this matchup is that Egg Roll and the landing animation from Down B sneak under Zelda's up smash, which is massive. Getting under Zelda's up smash is a massive benefit in this matchup because it's literally her best move. Or one of her best moves. Probably jab, tied with, or back air. But yeah, it's absurdly good. Anyone who's played versus Zelda know how annoying it is to get constantly down smash or up smashed in the neutral. Was lit, that was lit. That was, that was absolutely crazy. Yeah. So even game right now. I don't agree with this constant movement. Maybe he can end up getting caught, but right now it's a good start from LSG. We're good response from Zelda. Nair into up smash again. Good back air, 55%. Not using his jump. Double Nair down with smash. Gets him on, gets his edge control. Back air catches him doing a bad up, up smash. Another back air gets him on the ledge. Yeah. Also, to your point though, I feel like the, the movement, especially for LSG, is like it's super important to move versus Zelda because the only real bad. Thing that Zelda has is her inability to go faster than any other character in the game. So like the kind of the way you beat her is you can kind of use her movement to bait out options and punish them. The problem is oh my god, that almost killed. Super tight. Oh, that almost closed out the game. Oh, the, the egg was actually bad. The egg was actually bad. Yeah, exactly. Like, he would have landed. He would have died. Yeah, oh, landed. Oh my god, he did her Up smash or down smash. This is gonna be a heartbreaker for one of these two players right now. Oh my god. Yeah. The egg pressure I feel like is really good here, because like you're just constantly forcing Zelda to stay in the corner. Mm. Um, he's got Sire now. No down B. Zelda with Sunder is the worst nightmare of every player ever. Let's <laughs> say no tech face, that though. Kill. Yeah, he'll, he'll kill. That's game. Yeah, that'll do it though. Oh, Zelda with a steal. Yeah. Didn't fire still super strong. The egg not 
catching him instead of him forcing a landing, which would have caught a ton of lag, it would have been an easy punish. That was a click kill for LHG, and he kind of, oh, that's gonna be a heartbreaker. Yeah. I feel like at some point though, you just gotta have, like, if you're committed to throwing eggs at that point, like you guys just take that. Like you can't, you you can't you can't worry about what you could or couldn't have done, whether based on whether you were or were not throwing eggs, because at that point he was committed to to chucking those, which I understand. You know, last hit in the first game, you gotta be playing cautious. Ooh, platforms are actually gonna suck. Just looking at this matchup already, I'm like, oh, the platforms are not helping at all. I feel like the up smash through platform is brutal. Yeah, all this damage, so rough. Is he trying to find his way in? Not really successful at the moment. I feel like the flat state, the more flat stages are definitely gonna be beneficial for Yoshi in this matchup, but we'll have to see. Amazing start from Zelda so far, but. LG needs. LG could get one or two more openings, start to even out a bit more. Like that was a good egg roll gotten under the 19%. But still, this this is still going to be important for Zelda to be able to close the first stock. Yeah. Also, no jump from Zelda. Oh uh, yeah, that's that's brutal. That's brutal. I was going to say no jump. Oh, from he Zelda caught the arm, caught the armor, but didn't get anything out of it. That's that stock? Yeah, he got it. That's grounded. Yeah. A B, a B strong. Yeah. Or up down B. B. Not, Sorry, down B. Down B. Because it looks as it goes up, so it looks like it should be up B. Fair enough. It's more of an up -y than up -y, but... True. Potential to replace the moves. Make it even easier to just run around and throw eggs. Anyway, uh, LSG putting on, putting on kind of a lot of work in this matchup right now, I feel like. LSG's just I doing was... really good movement so far, and oh my god, LSG's almost yep. up two stocks. Yeah. This, remember the, when, like, yeah, Zeldad was up, like... There? You go ahead. No, you go ahead. Sorry, you were talking Yeah, first. I was going to say... Because uh, I think Zeldad's DI was like that too, because he got hit by that Nair and went super low. He was probably expecting up air, because, you know, Ellie, she's been fishing for up air stuff, like, the entire set. If, like, mis mixing up that Nair could get some early kills off the side. Also, also Ellie, she was so good at baiting out of smashes. Like, just the most obvious ones, and, like, yeah. getting tons out of it. But right now, Zeldad, good opening here. Oh my god, he is dancing. Oh, the armor! Yeah, that's... Big. That's a benefit for the throw combos, which you can actually pretty easily armor out of, but every other combo is going to be so difficult. Because, like, where you, where you, you get armor out of fair and then just get by another one because the frame bit is so good. Like, nah. The point I was going to make earlier is okay, Zelda now back in the lead, but Zelda was like blitzing in the beginning. And, like, Oshi really did crawl this to like a close game, but now Zelda started to get control, a bit more control. Right now, what do you think Zelda needs to do to make this a bit more convincing or maybe. You know, to so get more out of these situations because he's not playing the matchup wrong. He's just, it's just, you know, what I mean, Ellie's playing well. So, what do you think Zelda could do to play a bit better? Probably hold center more. I feel like LHG's only real advantage in this matchup, which we're kind of seeing, is his movement. He's really doing a good job. Like I think you said this earlier, of baiting out up smash, which is definitely a move you want to be baiting out. So either you know, try some other, like try jabbing more. If like jab is way faster and does pretty much the same thing. Or just like hold center to where you're not so worried about LHG's movement. You can kind of try to box him in a little bit more, which understandably is quite challenging. But it's the, really the way you win the matchup with Zelda. Zelda does not do well as a rushdown. Zelda's really good. Should, should be holding center with doing small dash dances, doing pivot jabs, stuff like that. Yeah. Like, that's much they're catching the the up B landing. Yeah, as I was say, not a spectacular up B, but in that situation, it's kind of hard to choose your spot. Again, another thing that's very important for LG right now is that not just because the, the Dins haven't been killing because of the armor, but also because it allows him to get in like decent positions. Because Dins is not like... Th it, there's some lag on Dins, so you can, you can actually get back to stage before Zelda can do anything. Mm -hmm. So it's not like you can just get, like, yo, do Dins, and then you make it a non-committal ma committal option. It's slightly committal. So, you know what I mean? Like, you can't... So when it lands on LG, does no knockback, allows him to get back to stage, it means it's almost like you almost reset neutral at that point. Mm -hmm. Also, I, I'm not sure if it's been noticed, but uh, Zelda started doing more jabs and nares in neutral, and he's been winning significantly more neutral. Yeah. As, as a That's result, good. so I'd go figure the harder to punish moves, but get you to win neutral more often. Pro tips That's from true. Kansas. Uh, we have the pro tips from the, the third best caster and the sixth best caster, but oh, yeah. the two best casters aren't available right now. The best caster is, is, is in the military, so. Yo, we love the military. All right. Anyway, Shout out Jeff is in the military. So. Okay. Oh, same thing. Fair enough. It's like... Ooh, reflector. The reflector just added a whole new dimension to this matchup. Oh my god! What a clean way to close. Yeah, Zelda definitely started cleaning up that game a lot more when he started using his more safe options in neutral. I feel like it's 
easier yeah. to contest Yoshi's kind of unga bunga options when you use the moves that are big and scary instead of the move that does it that gets low profiled by egg roll. True. Go figure. Right now, it's it's the last last game potentially, last game for LSG. I I kind of agree with the run back. There's that many options you can go. Again, it's not like an amazing matchup for Yoshi. So also home field advantage. So yeah. definitely definitely good there. Yeah, no jump actually. That's the messed up thing about all the melee top tiers is that all the melee toppers don't have a legal stage. Like, uh, none of them have a... uh, Jigglypuff? Question mark. Yeah, Jigglypuff Stadium, but Jigglypuff hates that stage in like the actual game. So it's a fair. Sure. Jigglypuff is like <laughs> that's like his worst... that's like Jigglypuff's second worst stage. Today. But even though it's a home court stage, like you know what I mean? Like Fox doesn't have a stage. Yeah. Fox used to have a stage in Corner that used to be legal, but then it wasn't. Yeah. Pokey Falco. Uh, Falcon Mute City stage. was legal back in the day. But now Expert it's not. Legal stage, Pokey floats. Don Kong True. Not, Don Kong is not a top tier, but yeah. D top tier DK. Yeah, I saw yeah. that. That was that. that, that was... That's just Zelda can sometimes just do that. Oh, you're dead. Go jump. Koki moment. That caught the jump. Do you act yeah. no, actually jump? No, he uh grabbed him out of his jump, and uh, I was like, the second he grabbed him out of his jump, I'm like, oh, you're just dead. You're, you're just oh, gonna that get. That explains why you couldn't get out of the ball. second grab. Yeah, you're either getting back thrown off stage or you're just gonna get up throw down smash and you're just gonna die. This is over. Like, I don't he actually locked, that's cool, but this is over. That's, that SDI that was crazy. Like how do you get out of there with enough time like, to up Notice for the LSG, but this game should be done. Like this is too big of a lead. Like, I think it's doable. It's definitely hard though. Uh Yoshi not, has some techniques. Yoshi has the damage output. Like, the problem is like Zeta just has to have like one or two decent reads and like this first stock's already gone. Like yeah. that first stock's okay. gone already. Like, yeah, up smash. I was up like, that was because he did one bad egg roll and he lost the stock. Like, this game is done. I know yeah, I sound like dumb. a hater when saying it, but like, this is just for pride now. Like, yeah, it's a pretty bad matchup. So, agree. Who cooking? Oh, he was. He was. He was. No, no. What happened right now? The the there's not enough time to like defrost the meat. We oh, try to true. cook. Like, there's not enough time. You have to take a while to defrost the oil. Preheat the oven. The oil isn't ready, I get you. The preheat the oven, they have to make sure you put all the spices and like potentially like breadcrumbs and stuff like that. You gotta make sure everything's there. I'm not a cook, do not take my advice. But you know what I mean? Like it's gotta take a while. I don't eat chicken fingers, that's for like six year olds. I eat actual like grilled chicken, like proper like chicken, you know what I mean? Like oh, 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 oh Dave! I would say Zelda saved no, 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 no. That should be, this should be just... Double, yeah. double spark hit is brutal, because he went from 50 to 82. That got, okay, that's a nice jump read, but again, that's just for pride. Like th at this point, until this, this stock, this stock is gone, then we're like, we can slightly entertain it. But until then, this is just... Well, this all just, complex got to start somewhere. True. I'm that's a believer. Game. No, is that game? No. Other side of the stage. Got worried about Din's fire, but I feel like you, you can weave back here. She's got the aerial drift. Okay, decent up, grounded up B, but... Again, like there's some good options here, but it's just well, where was this like done? Oh. I would say where was that a minute ago when you were when the game was winnable. But 30 and a handshake, clean cut, no chance. Th uh, top eight for all that. So uh, LHG's my goat for real though. So shout out to yeah. LHG. Oh, she's a goat for even trying this fucking matchup. <laughs> this looks like playing like cat and mouse, but you're the mouse. Like yeah, at least in cat and mouse you have options. True. The mask is more mobile, so in theory, so there's, there's ways. Well, Yoshi's, Yoshi's more mobile than Zelda, but it doesn't matter that Zelda. This is the equivalent of, like, being a 12-year-old with a baseball bat trying to beat a buzzsaw. Like, you're not going to beat a buzzsaw with a baseball bat. 